cameras on me. Ain't no telling what you gon' see. He ain't a boss, man. He getting bossed up. Watch a boss TV. Fix your eyes on me. Closed caption HD. It's Mike Cap exclusive. Miss Janae and DB. I'm tuned in like every day, like yesterday, like I will tomorrow. Your favorite rapper, your favorite singer, your favorite actress. We know all the stars. VIP whenever we come through. B.I.G. the only way we gon' do. I didn't play my part. I didn't pay the cost. Now I'm a book. And you could be one too. This is a Mike Cap exclusive on Boss TV, and I'm here with track and field Olympic star Earl Nolan. We're hosting his senior web series right here on Boss TV. What's going on, little bro? Ain't nothing much. Just chilling here. So look, your first week of your senior season. First of all, how you feeling so far? I'm feeling fresh. I ain't, I ain't do too much this weekend, so I'm ready to go. Ready to go. So first, you open up on the 200 meter dash, ran 21 and some change, 21 low, 06, I believe. You really haven't done too much speed work this season. Now, opening up as your first race. Tell me about that. And not doing sprint condition it was like you feel like you could do way more but you need that speed work to, to be sharp at the end of the season but i don't have that yet and you were going up against some some top athletes in the country like uh Prezzo hardy from texas a and m tell me about competing with sprinters that do this on the weekly basis and really have those fast twitch muscles not to say that you don't but they're really consistent this is their, those are their main event well i'm a 400 runner um I need to get, they're more sharp than me. I just need to get more sharp, then I'll get them by the end of the season. End of the season. So now that you, we haven't opened up in the 400 meter dash yet. We did uh, the Myrie leg ran, the anchor leg, uh, split 46 mid. Not bad for your first uh, race of the season as far as the 400 meters is concerned. Tell me about that and really wondering with your teammates. We have a strong team this year. We went right behind a and every time. So by um, 46 five split. That was easy. <laughs> <laughs> easy from Earl. You know, anything easy. That's why they call you easy. Uh. That's just the way I run. <laughs> so now let's just take a step back. Uh, you had a great year in 2012. I was able to run for your country, represent your country of Jamaica. And really to, not too many people know this, but you have been the teammates of some of the fastest athletes in the world, in Usain Bolt and Johan. Tell me about really competing with them and really having that, sharing that experience. It was more like competing with them. I was watching them, seeing what they did, what I do, compare it, contrast it. But hanging out with them and being with them, it was, it was a good experience. I really enjoyed myself. Did you really get a chance to sit down and talk with them? Uh, maybe get, just take something with you to really just learn and process in the future for your, as far as the sport of track and field and in life? Yeah, um, basically they both just told me not to be scared when I run. You could be nervous, but not scared. So I always took that with me when I got on the field and when I was about to run. This is a Mike Cap exclusive. Make sure y'all tune in every week. We're going to be here with Earl Nolan. He'll give you all the updates right here on Boss TV. It's Earl Nolan here, Team Jamaica. It's a Mike Cap exclusive on Boss TV. Uh -huh.